time video. It's gonna be my first story time. And I have been contemplating doing this <laughs> because this is like, you know, one of the many things that happened to me when I was young. And this is like one of the worst things, you guys. I know y'all read the title. So let me go ahead and get on with the story. Um, I hope I could tell this right because this is my first time doing something like this. And to be honest, no one else knows about this. None, none of my uh, friends, nobody, okay? Except for my sisters, I believe I told them. Anyway. Okay, so I think I was about 11, no, 11 or 12, something like that. I believe I was in the sixth grade in middle school. And you know in the black family, if there's anything good in the cabinets, the refrigerator, or the freezer, you have to ask for it, okay? So my mom, she would buy uh, vanilla, what what was it? Um, Bluebell, Bluebell vanilla ice cream. Okay, she would buy that kind and that only. We couldn't get cookies and cream, we couldn't get chocolate, we couldn't get nothing else. Okay, but Bluebell vanilla. All right, so we had some of that in the freezer. And so I went and I asked my mom, I said, Mother. Well, you know, back then I wasn't calling her mother. I was calling her mama. So, mama, um, can I have some ice cream? So she said that I can have some ice cream. So I got a cup of ice cream. Back then we would put ice cream in a cup. <laughs> I don't know about y'all. We didn't use bowls for ice cream, we used cups. So I went and got me some ice cream, put it in a cup. And mind you, before I tell you, this. We had a really, really bad roach problem at that apartment, okay? It wasn't that our house was dirty or anything. It was just that it was an infestation of roaches, okay? <laughs> I know somebody can relate. Somebody out there. Anyway, so, and there's a lot of stories with the infestation of roaches. Oh my God, this is just one of them. So I set my ice cream down on the table. I went to go do something. I don't remember what I went to go do. But um, I came back and I was so excited to finish eating my ice cream. It, looked, and it had um, melted some. You know how like it's, some of it is melted and some of it is actually um, frozen. So it, it's kind of like a milkshake. Okay, so. I go to dig in the ice cream, I, I uh, put a spoon in my mouth and and I felt something, I was like, I know she didn't get the vanilla ice cream with the pecans in it. I know she did, but maybe she did, okay? Because I was so excited, I didn't even look at the label. So, I just knew she always bought vanilla ice cream with nothing in it. So I start eating it. I'm thinking it's a pecan. And I was like, this don't taste right. So y'all, oh <laughs> I had already eaten some of it and I did, I dug in my mouth and I took out a friggin' leg, y'all. I had eaten a friggin' roach. A roach had crawled in my cup. While I was gone doing whatever it was I was doing, it crawled in my cup, y'all. And the reason I thought it was a pecan because it was in the cup and it was surrounded, you know, with cold ice cream, so it got hard, y'all. A hard roach. Oh my God. It was disgusting. It was absolutely disgusting. I could not believe it. So, the moral of the story is, I never sat my cup down ever again and just left it. 
because I knew that we had roaches, y'all. Y'all, we used to, <laughs> my dad used to put off uh, bombs in the kitchen and we'd wake up and there would be thousands of roaches everywhere, everywhere. Anyway, that is the end of my story. It was disgusting. I hope you guys don't unsubscribe. <laughs> from me but it's real y'all that's that's what's real okay i'm not getting on here making stuff up like some people do anyway um so that is the end of my story time don't judge me make sure you guys go and check out my video my wash and go video i will link it here and i will see you guys in another one I'm in love with the cold cold